Jansen coming off a weekend, getting a split against the Toronto Marlies. A uh, big win for your club the last time out. How did you see it all play out? Um, yeah, I think both games were pretty similar. I don't think we gave them too much. and uh, Just a bit more opportunistic the, the second game. And um, Yeah, I think, like I said, I think both were pretty solid. And when you look at those two games, it seemed like you were getting lots of chances and the puck wasn't just wasn't going in. And I mean, even if you look at that second game, hit the post four times. How does the team avoid frustration in a situation like that? Um, i just sticking with it, really. I mean, um, it's a good league. I mean, you get goalies, you get chances, and pucks bounce. And I mean, it's not going to go in every time. So uh, just sticking with it, I think, trying to stay pretty level. And um, yeah, you keep getting chances. I mean, you're, you're playing the right way. So I think uh, just having confidence in that. And for yourself, came into the lineup off an injury. How did you feel your first couple games? Uh, good, yeah. I think um, nothing too serious. It was kind of just getting my legs back under me after after a few days. So, um, yeah, I think I felt, felt good in both games and uh, just trying to kind of keep building. I mean, up until last game, you had a point in every game that you played in the AHL so far this season. I mean, what's worked for you offensively at this level? Um, I think kind of to, to a, my second point, just kind of sticking, sticking with it and trying to create chances. I think um, when you're getting chances, you're kind of playing um, the right way, at least offensively. So um, I think just trying to create, create opportunities out there for, for me and my line mates. And, um, you know, some games are going to drop, some games it, it kind of comes a little tougher. So uh, it's been good so far. And, yeah, just trying to, uh, just trying to kind of create, create offense. Looking at this Rockford team, you faced them uh, previously back in October, and uh, they bring a lot of speed to the table. So what challenges does that add uh, on the defensive side of the puck? I think just staying staying on top of them and um, just kind of playing in, in all three zones. Obviously, uh, the faster teams are, are good at transition, so uh, good, good F3 and uh, getting pucks deep are going to be important. And, and um, yeah, kind of using that to our strength, right? Teams that, that are good offensively, you know, try not to trade chances and, and stick to our game plan, and which is kind of, you know, simple through the neutral zone and getting pucks in the net offensively. So uh, try to create that way. Three games here on this trip before getting into the all-star break, but uh, how important is it to stay focused and on the task at hand rather than looking past them to a few days off? Yeah, I mean, it's different for me because, I mean, I just had uh, a couple of weeks I didn't really get to play. So uh, I think for me it's just kind of trying to enjoy playing again and and uh, getting a couple good games here and um, yeah just looking forward to, to the week.